comes the, here comes the, here comes the, y'all don't really want it like that, yeah. here comes the, no. here comes the, oh. here comes the, G'day folks, welcome to the final NQ Petro Brothers weekly wrap for 2018, proudly brought to you by ASN Cans for all, all your supplement needs. Winners are grinners, and congratulations to our Kennedy's Better Home Living Colt side, proving too strong for a very resilient Kangaroos side in the grand final of the Kansas District Junior, uh, sorry, Kansas District Rugby League Colts competition. The side advanced directly through to the grand final following their uh, semi-final win over Innisfail Leprechauns. Uh, that meant that they had the week off, and they started just a little bit rusty. Kangaroos racing out to an eight-point lead. Uh, via two unconverted tries before a little bit of field position and some possession. Uh, saw George Wassimo open the scoring uh, for Brothers uh, before Sterling Amber and Helam Lukey both crossed to take an 18 points to 8 lead into half time. Uh, coming out into the second half, Dennis Dow crossed uh, before Hamaso Tabuai Fido streaked away 90 metres uh, to score a wonderful try. And then uh, somewhat of a, another comeback from Kangaroos was thwarted when Dennis Dow crossed for his second, uh, with Sterling Addo uh, converting five of the six attempts uh, for a personal haul of 14 points in the 34 points to 20 win. Uh, the boys always seem to be in control following that opening 10, and they really put their foot down. Uh, to come away with the win in the end. And the most pleasing aspect of that was the number of under 17 year olds uh, playing in that game, which certainly bodes well for our future next year and the year after in that underage competition. So huge congratulations to those boys. Well done on a fantastic season. A huge congratulations also to Yaraba, who uh, snatched victory from the jaws of defeat, scoring two tries in the final five minutes to overcome a, a really good quality suburb side in what was an albiter of a game. Congratulations to Yaraba and also the suburbs for, for their achievements through the year. And in the A grade clash, uh, commiserations to Tully, they were stoic in their defeat. Uh, they're, they're really a resilient bunch and, and they're certainly a side that you have to defeat and that was the case in the weekend. Uh, they didn't beat themselves. Mossman, Port Douglas Sharks celebrating their first grand final victory in 21 seasons since 1998. So congratulations to you guys. You were, you were exceptional on the evening and played a, a beautiful brand of football. It was open, it was exciting and it was physical when it needed to be. So congratulations to you guys. We certainly look forward to taking you on again in 2019. Uh, that's it for the games, however, we still do have one event left to run as the club celebrates the season that was 2018 with a presentation evening to be held on Friday the 12th of October in the auditorium at the Leagues Club where we'll celebrate the club's achievements this year which included being crowned as club champions, also the A grade minor premiership, reserve grade finished the semi-finalists and as we mentioned earlier the Kennedy's been a home living Colts uh, lifting the premiership trophy uh, and in addition to that we'll obviously also recognise all the individual achievements throughout uh, 2018 and we will crown the Colt of the Year and also the Bob Mully medalist as the A grade best and fairest player. Hopefully we get to see as many of you all there as possible for what is always a wonderful evening. Until next year, go the fish.